वेलकम टू साइबोटेक एजुकेशन ग्रुप टूडे द मेन एम ऑफ द लेसन इज टू लर्न अबाउट डिफरेंट लुकअप फंक्शन डिफरेंट लुकअप फंक्शन द लुकअप फंक्शन इज द टाइप ऑफ फंक्शन दैट इज यूज टू फाइंड और सर्च एनी पर्टिकुलर वैल्यू either in the horizontal or in the vertical database actually there are three different lookup functions the first one is the view lookup the second one is the edge lookup and the third one is the lookup function each and every lookup function has different syntax and uses so first of all i'm going to explain about the function view lookup which syntax is in which there are four parameters the first parameter is the value that is to search value that is to find okay i'm just writing it as a value the second parameter is the range or it may be known as the database the third parameter is the column number which corresponding value is to obtain column number and the fourth parameter that is actually an optional parameter and that's why i'm writing it in the in this bracket its value may be false or true this is the proper syntax this is the proper syntax of the view lookup function okay in this function in this function actually the given value the given value is searched in the first column in the first column of the given range it is the important point if the value is not found if the value is not found error is given in the form of value in the form of error value actually but if the value is found the value in the corresponding column in the corresponding given column is returned <clears throat> here it must be considered it must be known that as a fourth parameter false is written if data are in the sorted order in the sorted order okay this is this is this is very important point and the value true and the value true is written if data are not in the sorted order okay so it is very important these these two points are very important i am making it bold okay now i am shifting myself from uh, word to ms excel in which i am going to design 
the vertical database. Suppose there are four columns. The first column is role, the second column is name, the third column is address. Okay. I am writing some roles in the ascending order. Suppose there are 10 roles. Here there are some names. Now I'm writing addresses. Suppose roll one is belonging to Patna. Similarly, Navada, Gaya, Delhi, Pune, Mumbai, Chennai. Kolkata, Ranchi, and Delhi. Okay. Now this is the vertical database. I'm just inserting a row, merging it. And setting the horizontal element to center and writing here vertical database. I'm making it bold and underline. Okay. This is the vertical database. Now I'm going to use the function VLOOKUP equals VLOOKUP. Suppose I have to find the role 5. Okay. As far as the syntax is concerned and its uses are concerned, I have already mentioned that the given lookup value is found in the first column of the given range. And here I am giving the range from A1 to C12. It means the first column is A. So the value, the given value 5 will be found in the column A. Now suppose I have to get the name of, of the student which role is 5. The name is the second column and that's why I am writing here 2. And since the whole database is in the ascending order on the value of the role, so I am writing here false. If it will find the value 5 here, the name Mukesh must be returned back and this is here. This is the use of the VLOOKUP function. Here I am using the value of role to find the value of name. Similarly we can use the, the same function to find the address. Now suppose there is a, there is a student with the role 6. I have to find it. I am giving the range A1 to C12. Since I have to find out the address of this particular student and the address is the third column, so I am writing here 3. This is the corresponding column. And as, a, as the fourth parameter, I am writing false. The result is Mumbai. And here, roll number 6, whatever the name is, the address is Mumbai. That is here. The VLOOKUP function can also be used the VLOOKUP function is or can also be used to find any particular name that is that is a text and that's why it is written under double quotation. Now as a range I have to give 
from B2 or B1, it may be B1 to C12. Okay. Now I can't find the value of Rol because in the given uh, range, the Rol is not present. Now name is the first column because as per the uh, given range because uh, in the given range B is the first column so to find the address instead of writing 3 I have to write 2 now if we write here false okay whatever the result the result is Gaia okay that is the address of the value Dhoni it is okay now if we use the same function find Dhoni in the range B2 to C12 the address is the second column suppose we write true then it is not found this is the error message that is uh, that is telling that the value is not available it means not available okay so this is the use of the vertical lookup function that is known as the vlookup function now again ab kya karo True or false का क्या है? समझ रहे हैं? Short order में नहीं रहता है ना? तो एक बार लेकिन short order में था एक बार short order नहीं रुक जाएगा कहाँ है कि बहुत ये हो जाएगा अब इसको थोड़ा सा बहुत कल कर रहे हैं save कीजिए ना इसको कहाँ है कि अगला भी फिर और बड़ा बढ़ाइएगा बस ये इतना है हाँ बिल्कुल बस पंद्रह मिनट हो गया पंद्रह मिनट नहीं हुआ पंद्रह मिनट हो गया ज्यादा का तुम वीडियो दोगे ना डाउनलोड करने में ये होता है हाँ। दिक्कत करता है ठीक है हाँ, ठीक है ठीक है इसको सीधा नो करो ओके ठीक है सर आप उसमें बता दीजिए कि आगे हम डिस्कस करेंगे दो चीज पर हाँ उसको भी हम यही चीज हम कहना चाह रहे हैं उसको भी हाँ। हम कर रहा है उसको नो करो तो सामने है ये है या इन टूडे लेसन टूडे the function vlookup has been discussed in the future lesson in the future lessons we will discuss about more lookup functions and other functions